Hey, so I'm assuming you're a boot enthusiast like I am because you're watching this video. So if you are like me, you might sign up for text or emails for some of the boot companies that you really want to know, uh, you know, when they got a sale or something going on and you, know, you get those emails and a lot of them I just, um, you know, cause I'm not going to buy a boot right now. I'll just, I'll delete them right away without really looking at them. But the other day I get an email by company that, you know, I get a lot of them from, but uh, I was uh, interested with the, the uh, subject line or whatever that they had on there. So I opened it up and boom, could not believe the, the, the picture of the boots um, that I saw on there. And it was like, love at first sight. And I have never made a quicker decision and purchase for a pair of boots like I did that day. Literally, uh, I think within two minutes, three minutes, I was ordering those boots because uh, I just had to have them. They were so uh, perfect in their details, I think, um, that I just loved. And I got them the other day, and we're going to look at those boots today. Hey, boot tubers, Bobby Boots here. So, which were the boots that made me make that call so fast as to, I have to have these boots right now? And I literally purchased those things within like three minutes. Let's take a look. Tacovas. Which Tacovas? Well, this is not an unboxing, but I'm going to pull them out of the box just so you can see because I've already actually uh, uh, pulled these out to look at them already. But look at that. So Tacovas comes out with this limited edition. By what I've been told, they've only made 1,500 of these. Um, they have a men's version and uh, a women's version. And this is the men's version, which is called the the Justice. I don't know if it was 1,500 of these and 1,500 of the women, um, but look at that boot. Let's get them both out of here. Um, for any of you new to boots um, and not familiar with Tacovas, uh, they have a process where you order them online and they'll send them to your house and uh, they'll provide you what you need to be able to uh, send these back real easy for free if they do not fit and they'll send you the right size to you get it all worked out um, Super super uh, company to work with um, As you can see here, uh, it is a Texas company. They are designed in Austin, Texas. They are made in Leon, Mexico where uh, a large majority of the boots and shoes uh, are, are made so <clears throat> This is uh, the justice and <laughs> I just absolutely fell in love when I saw this um, They do such a fantastic job with their their photography their marketing They shot a fantastic of the two boots the, the, the Liberty and the justice to together and To me, I just think they nailed it absolutely nailed it in the details uh, Let's Pull one of these away here so we can take a little better look at this Um but there's a few things that, that really stood out to me, okay? Obviously, you have the very patriotic um, look to the boot, and that's what they're going for. This is in celebration of Independence Day. Um, that's why it's coming out um, just before uh, the 4th of July, about a week before. And so you've got the, the, the navy blue, okay? And I'll show close-ups on this stuff later, but you've got the red stitching in there You've got the white star and the, the white cording that goes down piping that goes down uh, on the side here on the shaft and So you've got the red white and blue. Okay, you've got star um, I loved the natural leather with this together um, And the white it, the whole combination of the, the colors. I think it just goes together perfectly um, with what they did with the outsole and the heel uh, of the, 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 the color of the leather as well. Uh, just fantastic. Another thing that I love is um, the pull straps here, they went with the natural to bring out this, um, the, to accent this, where they could have easily just did a, a, a navy there. Uh, I think it looks great. I mean, it's a, it's a minor thing, but it really adds to um, the look of the boot. Um, the stitching is, as you'll see in these close-ups here, is pretty um, simple as far as you, you've got the, the three rows on, on each one of the cording, um, but it, I, I like the simplicity of this boot. And one of the other things that I really liked was what they did with this star 
um, in the design of the cording where these come to this point here on the star and these come up and follow these lines and then this comes into that point right there um, I think they did a fantastic job with this design and the whole the, the whole package together of, of the look of this boot is what made me um, make that call so quick I was like I, I just absolutely love this boot and I have to have it um, and as you can see it is um, a round toe I am normally a square toe guy for uh, those of you watching my videos you'll, you'll know that um, but I am starting to uh, venture out into some of these other toes and um, with this boot I think it uh, it, it really uh, it really works I think it just um, goes more to that style we are going to uh, well let me give you before we go into, into trying this thing on uh, let me go uh, on a rundown on some of the the little details here um, this is a 12 inch shaft okay and it is a inch and a half heel which I think is is a great size heel um, for keeping that comfort, so that you can you can walk for a long time and, and, and still um, not feel as much strain on your calves, and um, where where some of the higher ones can do so. Yet in, you know it's not down to the, the height of a of a roper, so it gives a little bit more of that that classic traditional look of a, uh, a traditional cowboy boot, um, but yet still keeping that comfort. Uh, it is calfskin uh, throughout, and um, the leather just feels fantastic, as always. Um, this is my second pair of Tacovas, and uh, they are leather-lined, which I'll also show in some more uh, close-up stuff, and they just feel like uh, so silky smooth and soft when you, when you put your foot in there. Um, and then it has the... Um, leather insole as well on these and they do the uh, those of you familiar with it you know this but just for, for any of you newer guys out there um, they do it to where they cover up the seams to where these these two uh, leathers on your shaft come together um, instead of having that uh, sticking up and rubbing against your leg they, they cover up that with leather so you just get a nice smooth uh, comfortable feel in there instead of having that rub on on your leg um, I mentioned Zanarto inch and a half heel um, again, uh, this is for uh, Independence Day, um, and I just want to read what they have on their website to give you an idea of their thought towards this. Uh, it says, light up the 4th of July with the Justice. This limited edition calfskin boot in natural, uh, which is this color right here. It's classic cowboy in shape and all-American in looks. It's star-studded navy shaft and unique cording pattern. Make uh, for one-of-a-kind boot that is both celebratory and refined. Uh, wear it proudly. Now, they have another cool thing on this. Um, this is what I wanted to read. Um, but it says, we'll be donating $25 from every pair of the Liberty and the Justice sold before the 4th of July directly to Patriots Hall in Dripping Springs, Texas. Uh, it's got friends that live there. It's pretty cool. Uh, and their mission to provide a safe retreat where veterans of all ages can seek out support and uh, community um, so that is the 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 justice and uh, I'm going to do a, a try on of these to see how these fit see if um, uh, I'll need to return these for a different size I which by the way I didn't show you the um, the bottom of these uh, they got the, the rubber heel cap on there which actually has a very nice um, texture to it um, uh, which should help for uh, and, and just the feel of it should, uh, with, with slipping, shouldn't be as much. Um, they do have um, lemon wood pegs in here. Um, the, the, the Goodyear welt, so which is a, a single stitching on that. Um, I'll show you close-ups on all that stuff later. Um, but just uh, a, a fantastic quality boot. And I, actually, I was quite surprised. I expect when I saw the limited edition, normally when they do that kind of thing, it's a lot of times it's on more of their expensive boots and with just the, the different details here the adding the 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 star and the different colored leathers and and um everything the whole package i expect it to actually be more but this is a 255 fifty-five dollar boot and for this quality this nice boot i think uh that's a that's a, just a a great price but we're going to do a try on of these and then we'll 
uh, wear these boots so you can see what they um, get an idea of, uh, of uh, what they look like. But it's uh, this is a Justice by Tecovis. All right, so we're gonna see how these babies fit. Um, I am wearing my uh, Wrangler uh, boot socks. I'm gonna go ahead and put both these on. I did uh, my very first video was on these socks. Absolutely love these socks. So it didn't get as much pop. I normally like to get uh, these boots, although they're so slick inside. Just kind of seems like they uh, just slide right into it. They're a lot easier than uh, what some of the other ones do. I, first of all, besides the, the fit of them, I think they look fantastic. I love that color. Seeing them with these dark blue jeans just makes them really pop, I think. Um, Let's see. I mean, they, they feel uh, very comfortable. The arch seems to be in the right spot. Toes feel um, very, very much um, comfortable as far as enough room. They don't feel like they're pinched in there, which uh, with this type of toe, I often uh, uh, will have a problem with. Um, vamp. Um, it seems, I think it seems pretty good in there. They are gonna loosen up with um, time. Um, a good amount of um, heel slip. Uh, well, there's too much. Kind of hard to tell, especially when you're just walking this little bit. Um, my, my, my fear with these is if I go down to an eight and a half that uh, I have a problem with the toe. Um, it's always a real iffy thing with me. I've got eight and a half to, and square toe uh, into Kovas that are just really too tight. Um, I stuck with them when I shouldn't have. Um, so I'm afraid if I go down eight and a half in these, that's just, um, it's going to be too much, too, too small. I don't want to be too big. Um, for those of you who aren't familiar, um, the Tacovas and the way their system works for returning these, um, you need to try these on on carpet so that you're not, um, Messing up the leather. Let me show you the bottom there. I love what they did with the uh, that white stripe and the, the cording down the side there. It's, I love the way that sets that off. The contrast. Um, so yeah, they, I mean they just feel great. Um, I'm not sure about that. Uh, the, the heel slip would be the, the main concern that I have. Um, and normally, again, you want to have definitely more pop when you put your. This is a little better. Let's try it again. And these things just smell fantastic. That's yes, right. And these are a slightly thicker sock. Um, there you go, those are the uh, Tacova's Justice. Well, uh, gonna have to think about these a little bit more as far as it, um, as far as keeping these or if I try a different size. Um, but I think they look fantastic. Hey, boot tubers. All right. So we've looked at some of the details of the boots and, uh, you know, some close ups and that kind of stuff. But now I think it's time to try these beauties on. Let's, uh, do some, uh, different looks. We're going to head down to the park. It's a little cloudy out, but, uh, we'll see how we can, uh, we can do down there with, uh, trying some different styling with these boots and, uh, 
try some different uh, color combinations and uh, types of shirts, that kind of thing. But uh, I think you're going to like it. So I'm wearing my Levi's 527, which is a boot cut uh, jean. And my first go-to combination when I'm going to wear boots is to find a shirt that pretty much matches the same color of the boots. This is a shirt by Redhead brand company, sold by Cabela's, and very, very similar color. So I just like that look. This is my beater hat by Justin. With this option, I wanted to show a short sleeve and a pattern, and also with the untucked look for more of a relaxed fit. This shirt is by Lee. Has a little cactus pattern to it, but it's a nice accent color, complementary color to the color of the boot. Now here, I definitely wanted to go with more of a, a Western feel. Completely different look when you add the vest. I love the look. This vest is literally decades old by a company called Structure. It's a nice little accent. This shirt is by Dockers. The interesting thing about this shirt is it has three colors of stripes. It has a blue stripe, uh, which pulls out the color of the jeans. It has a color that matches the boots. And then there's also a third color, which has that orangish color of almost identical to the belt. The belt is by Nobleman's Apothecary, which is handmade by Angel Rios. America, baby. Hey, I hope you can see that I think Tacova's nailed it with these boots big time. Man, just every little detail, whether it was the, the design, uh, the, the, the cording, the colors, just nailed it. And I'm so glad they did. I'm so glad that they uh, had this come out before the 4th of July in celebration of the independence of this fantastic nation. I'm going to wear them happily, proudly uh, for the, the 4th. And uh, that's actually why I, I've got this video out now is um, I wanted to get all the footage shot so that I can be wearing these boots um, for the, the Independence Day. And even though I've got some other videos I've already started, I had to do this one because I wanted to wear these boots um, because of, you know, getting not be able to scratch up the bottoms to, to return these and I want to be able to do that. So um, if you like this video in any way, if it helped you out, just enjoyed it, whatever, uh, enjoyed looking at these boots, talking about boots, uh, please hit that like button. And then even better than that, if you can hit that subscribe button, that really helps out this channel to be, be able to keep producing these for you guys. And then also, uh, if you want to get notified of when the next video comes out, hit that notification button and that'll help you as well. Uh, help all of us. And we can just enjoy these things together in this, this world of boots and uh, just talk about boots and uh, look at boots and see how good ways to wear them and um, just grow together in, in, in the world of boots. And uh, I thank you for watching. I thank you for subscribing to the, the few of you I've got out there. I uh, really, really appreciate it. And uh, let's just keep loving those boots.